Hi everyone, Articulo JP here back with another figure review and for this particular review I have here for you a 20th anniversary Pokemon movie SH Figure Arts box set and here is the box as you can see it comes with Ash, Pikachu, Team Rocket, Jesse and James Meowth of course and here's the top the bottom side and finally the back here showcasing you again the figures and all the accessories they come with and all the poses that you could do with them so without further ado let's go ahead and open this up so the limited edition set also comes with the brown shipper box and here it is and it just shows you um, limited edition Satoshi and Team Rocket Let's set that aside and let's go ahead and open this up. So since I can't open it at the bottom, I'm just gonna choose this side here and let's choose the Team Rocket side. Right there. And okay, so. Oops. And here it is. The whole set looks and accessories there. Um, whoa, cool! So it comes with Team Rocket's logo. Um, anything else in the box? Nope. That's it. So set that aside. There comes with an instruction manual. Thing in the back, so I guess this is for the stand too. That's cool. Okay, so we will set this aside and let's take these guys out of this one. All right, so here is the whole set out of that plastic packaging. Um, first of all, I want to talk about Ash here. He does come with. Um, one, two, three, and the fault. So four hands for the right hand, and just one open palm. And of course, I would drop it, and just one open palm for the left hand, and also the default fist hands right there. Um, so for this one, you get the hand with the Pokeball. Let me try to see if I could focus. And this one, unfortunately, it doesn't come out of his hand, so it's just glued in there. The paint job and the detail is okay. See that little part there that needs to be cut. I think an extra plastic. Open palm. Also pointing and for the faces he comes with of course the default one that came out of the box from let's see if I focus on her and his mouth open happy smiling uh, the crying face Serious one right here. Just another one. Um, let's look at this one again. You can see the tears there, and also an extra set of hair for when you don't want his hat on. And Pikachu. Somewhat articulated, uh, the head swivel, look up and down as much. The arms, unfortunately, just swivels as well. Could move up this much, that low. Feet, no articulation in the feet. Um, but the lower area of his body where the leg is just swivels as well. Tail, no articulation there. But he does come with an extra face, 
So in order to switch that, just pop it right off and stick it just like so. So he can be on his four legs or stand up just like that. So, and also we're gonna take a look at the figure now. There's this accessory that you could put in the back. It's basically like, so Pikachu could rest on his shoulder. So this tab right there, and you kind of just sit Pikachu right there. So that's a really neat accessory. Um, let's go ahead and take this out. And let's talk about Ash catch from here. Okay, so Ash, the material for his jacket is rubber. Articulation wise, he could look down this low with using his um, torso here, that high for head, that low and that high. Swivel, arms, you know, a wide range of motion there. Elbows, hand swivel. So legs, feet, and for changing his face, the facial expression, you take off the hat just like that. Also, I kid you not, you take off his bangs right there, and you finally take off the face. So if we want this crying face stick it right there don't forget his bangs you gotta make sure you stick it there firmly and finally you put on his hat just like that the paint job on ashes it's okay I mean I like I get that the rubber part is kind of hard to paint so but I st still get some blotches there like look right here it's an okay paint job so oh forgot about this toes articulation maybe yeah no because it's the whole consider it as feet so that's how you change it. You know, set him aside, he's crying right now. So let's take a look at Team Rocket. Um, for Meowth, let's start with Meowth. Standard articulation swivel, look down that low, look up that high, head swivel. The arms, not so much, so just around like that. not even but it, it is made out of rubber so you could kind of could twist it around but it'll just fall back right into the place just like that also the tail as well the tail yeah you could there's a swivel there the tail paint job um, I would say okay as well so a pretty neat actually not too much thing going on here and you could change me out's expression as well so you just pop this up and just put it in just like that so it comes with an extra face so for Jessie here she comes with again two right hands fist and pointing And the left hand just comes with fist hands. So Jesse here, um, it's kind of hard for her to stand because of the hair and the weight. So she tends to kind of fall down. But very simple design. Um, this vest or shirt is made out of rubber, as well as a skirt. Articulation wise, um, the head, I you know, I don't want to play around too much with this, but it does have 
it does have a cut right here. Huh. But see, so down, look up. So right there, legs, feet, hands, arms. And to change your faces, similar to Ash, just pop this open and switch it. And this is the face that she comes with. Extra face there. And for James here. Of course, the same thing. This one though, it's not rubber, it's just pure plastic. As the rest of them. And the only, one of the gripes I have is like, they, they're just looking on the side. So he's looking this way, Jesse's looking that way. And you can't really change that because they don't come with that much facial expression. Just another one, which is the blasting off again. Um, sorry about that. My video got cut off because of the memory issue. Anyway, I was talking about James here. And they don't really come with that much accessories too. When it comes to facial expression and um, hands and other accessories. Anyway, one of... The accessories it comes with is a facial expression of blasting off again and the blasting off. So this is it. Also for his right hands um, holding the rose and open palm. The left just one hand and it's an open palm hands. So um one of the gripes I have too is the stand. I mean, they only give you one stand. They could just give you another one of these because it, you could just plug them into any of these right here, but they just give you one. So that's that. And for the Team Rocket logo right here, they give you this stand for it. So you slip it in there and stands just like that and you could put it behind them slide so so anyway guys this is a quick review of the SH figure arts Pokemon um, 20th anniversary the movie and you know what let me see if I have actually I have here For just comparison's sake, I have the SH Figure Arts, and he's a little bit dusty because I display him outside, but SH Figure Arts Charizard. So let's see if I can put him right next to Ash right here. So just a quick comparison, that's Charizard right there. And Venusaur for the D Arts line. So you judge it if to me it seems like they're a little bit tinier than what they should be. But anyway, this is again the Message Figure Arts limited edition box set for Pokemon the movie 20th anniversary and I hope you enjoyed the video and please subscribe and give me a like for more videos also if you would like to see more action figure photos head on over to my Instagram account at particular JP and I'll see you guys there peace